What's going on guys? My name is Naughty Estridge and today we are doing a Pokemon Nuzlocke. Now if you've never heard of a Pokemon Nuzlocke, I'm going to try and write Naughty Estridge. It's probably going to be one character short like everything is. Yo. No, we're just going to be Naughty. See, I don't think I've ever played a Switch game on the channel. Alright, so this is a Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke, because I play Pokemon Shield. I've already beaten the game on my account, and I've got all level 100 Pokemon, so I created a new account. Just called Nuzlocke, because this is the only thing I'm going to use it for. So let's get into it. Part one of the Pokemon Nuzlocke. Alright. Before we do this, can I pause? Hello. Right, welcome one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. We've all heard of you. Is this the chairman? I think that's what it is. The chairman. I think that's who he is. I I haven't seen this guy in ages since the um this is the guy that summoned it. Wait, am I allowed to do spoilers? <laughs> No spoilers, this is the guy that does something very important. This guy is very important late in the game. Just gonna say, darkest day. Those who choose to reign and train. Raise and train, not reign and train. We call Pokemon trainers. Woo woo Pokemon! Now time to skip the dialogue, it's boring. Hello Rose. Leon, 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 Leon. We beat Leon in. I, I beat Leon in the game, but. I tell you, beat the game, you have to beat Leon. And his famous Charizard. That's not really a spoiler, because you can see it right to his left. Woo, Leon! Hop's brother. Hello, Hop's brother. Oh, Ryan. Raihan? Is that how you say it? He's the dragon gym leader, the final gym leader. Oh, Dynamax Charizard. This, this is why I'm choosing a certain Pokemon. Now, if you don't know the rules of Pokemon and Nuzlocke, we can only catch one Pokemon per route. Pokemon faints, we cannot use it. It's an F in the chat. Not sure if this will be easy or hard. Um I'm not I'm honestly not sure. Also, to make this a little harder, it's really easy to beat the game. We can only use we cannot use Dynamax raid battles unless absolutely necessary. I'm going to try and not use Dynamax Raid Battles because they're really, they're the easiest way to beat this game. You get a lot of candy, you pretty much, that's how you beat the game. You get Dynamax Raid Battles. Alright, so this is, this is where we pick our starter. I hope you all know, if you're looking for your badge, Bag. I can't remember where my bag is. Even to this day, I never remember where the bag is. I couldn't find the bag. First fun fact. Oh yeah, it's in. This is my room. It's like Dad's old bag. Okay, I'll skip until we're in the interesting stuff. We're ready to go. Hello, hop. Okay, we got some badu. Hello, look. Here is hop. And here is a Wooloo giving itself brain damage. I just banged my head on a chair. I'm that disappointed. No, this makes me want to bang my head on a fence. No, is it just going to keep doing it? I actually want to stay here and just see if it keeps banging its head against the fence. Come on, Wooloo. Man, no, it's not gonna do it. 
Ooh, a Butterfree. And a Woo. But what's this guy gonna say? Nothing. So we can't go past there. We have to go right here to get our starter Pokemon. Think this is where I go? Yeah, Hop's house. Hello, Hop. Mama Hop. Yeah, Hop, no need to show off that your brother is the undefeated champion. He's not gonna be undefeated for long. Because we are going to Nuzlocke him. We're gonna lock it. We're gonna lock the Nuz. Alright. I'm gonna nuzzle his lock. That sounds weird. Oh, we're just gonna we're just gonna do a nuzz lock and hope it's good. Stay clear of the tall grass. You be you better know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and get in. Oh, I don't care. I don't care enough. Oh yeah, we don't have the Rotom bike. Oh, I thought I was smart. Oh, maybe I am. Nope, I'm not. I'm not. I thought I was smart. I didn't think he. Well, we could buy the expansion pass, but I'm just not willing to. Hello, Lee, Lee, Lee. <laughs> that smile, though. I was going to say what's Lee and doing, Leon doing here, but I just remembered he's from here, probably. His hop is from here, and he's Hop's big brother. Woo, Leon. Woo. Lee, Lee. Number one fan in the world has come out his way to pick me up. <laughs> exactly an inch. Bingo. Perfect. We're seven minutes into the game and we haven't even got a Pokemon. That just proves how much text is in this game. Okay. Whenever he does that, everyone goes wild. I can do that. I'm not going to because I'm doing a Nuzlocke and I don't want to get distracted. Pokemon Shield logo? Oh. Everyone plays Pokemon Sword, but I play Pokemon Shield because... Pokemon! Now I've taken... I've taken some time to think who should my starter be? Now, besides either Sobble or Grookey. Score Bunny. Unless you count first gym, he's not that best. So I decided to base it off who's better. Let's see. Grookey can do the water gym, and the grass gym's not too bad for him. Well, you're gonna have to swap out. You know what? I've just thought Sobble. Screw you, Score Bunny. I don't like Score Bunny. I was trying to act like I'm smart, but what I actually mean is I prefer Sobble. I like Sobble the most. So Score Bunny. Score Bunny has not learned Ember yet. And you have not learned, I don't know. I have no idea what's going on. All right, line up, everyone. Oh, what you know what I said about Score Bunny being the worst? I've decided that Score Bunny's not the worst. Grookey, I don't. No one likes Grookey. If you pick Grookey, you're different. You're unique. So here's the thing. Leon has a Charizard. So, it makes sense to go Sobble. Sobble's the coolest, because Inteleon's the coolest. So, it makes sense to go Sobble. 
Let's hope Sol survives to Italian. <laughs> Zering, this is a nice locket for faints. Game over. Yes. Oh, yeah, I have to give a nickname to it. Uh. Can I name it Squirtle? Yeah, that's a squiddle. <laughs> I named it Squiddle. Squiddle. <laughs> what a great Squiddle. Score Bunny, you're mine. What an idiot. How stupid can you be? If I were him, I would have just gone for the Grookie. Grookie. Because then Grookey could clap my cheeks. Because I learned water. Water gun, water gun. I learned water gun. Once I, if I beat his woo-woo. Also, he gets gro Grookey. There's a thing. I always thought it's good to pick Score Bunny. When I sorry, Grookey. Because then he's stupid and he picks Sob. Wait, no, no, no. Pick Score Bunny, because then he picks Grookey, and then Leon gets Sobble. And I thought that, because Sobble can defend himself against Charizard at least a little bit. Well, if Charizard attacks Grookey, that thing's dead. Hello, the next, the next day. <laughs> of course I have Lee. Listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself. Trust one another. One day you keep on battling, battling unbeatable champion. What about Lee? No, oh, you think Noddy? Oh, you might lose to him, miss out champion. Just have a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer. You know, proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to first rate in battle. Guess I'll be the judge of that. What if I say no? Oh, so. Oh, so it will just. I have no idea what happens, but. No, I would have walked off, but I know he's got Score Bunny, and I know I learned Water Gun, so. Dun, 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 dun. Hop. No, I know he's got his Wulu, and then he's got Score Bunny, of course. I don't know why he needs a start. Wait, how did he even get a Wulu? Now, I'm garbage at naming Pokemon, so don't expect me to be good at, like, have good names. But I have to name them, so I named my Squirtle. I'm going to get roasted for that, for not even naming it Squirtle. I was trying to call it Squirtle Clone, but that didn't fit, so I wrote Squiddle. Because I was just going to write Squirtle. And then I wrote Squiddle. Can't wait to get roasted. I should go to the name changer, but to be honest, Squiddle's just gonna become like a meme. It's gonna be a channel meme. Squiddle. <laughs> it looks like a knockoff Pokemon game. Squiddle, a bootleg game. Score Bunny. Dumbass. Did you see the clear animation where School Bunny got destroyed? Oh. Did you already know about type advantages? How did you not know about type advantages? Water beats fire. I've never lost this battle, but I wonder what would happen if you lose. Oh, we'll never know because I don't want to lose Sobble. Is there a if I ever do this with another Pokemon game and I lose the first battle, here's the policy. I can keep the Pokemon, but the first Pokemon I catch... You know how I can catch how I catch the first Pokemon on the first... The first Pokemon I see per route. I have Sobble. I catch the first Pokemon I see on the route. And then I have to take out Sobble off the team and I just have that one Pokemon. To be a rival to hop, push him, make him put his strong. You 
join the gym challenge? You think you're ready? Not putting the cart before the rapid dash on the little brother. And especially your friend Naughty. Best think about getting badges, trainers, Pokedex. Oh, check. Naughty, did you hear that? Oh, the Wooloo's brain just got destroyed. Oh, no, no, the Wooloo actually broke free. It's tackling the fronts. You don't think it got through? Oh, man, it's not supposed to go in there. What do you say? I don't know. So I said no, and we're still going in. No, I'm not going. No. Stupid hop. Wait, no, what if I... Just stupid hop. Hop. Hop, hop, hop. What if I pass him? Can I then go back? Damn it. Developers actually thought... They actually thought about things. I said I don't want to help the stupid Wooloo. It's the it's its fault. It's the Wooloo's fault. Now we're in the slumbering world. The worst spot. Now, here's the thing. Considering we cannot catch Pokemon, here is my policy with this. I can come back later in the game. I have to catch the first Pokemon that I see. Not now, but when I come back. So if the first first Pokemon I see, it's a Squirtle. See, I can't if I don't find a Squirtle and I can't find a Squirtle. What I'll do is I'll just come back. No, I should run, but I'm gonna use a water gun to get the XP. With my Squirtle. Uh, the whole point of naming them is to get attached to the Pokemon. But this Squirtle is just Squirtle. I can't. I, I, I'm up it. So this Squirtle, I think he only knows Tail Whip and maybe Tackle. I mean, every Pokemon knows Tackle, it seems. All right, 11 XP. Well, I know this place. Wait, right, well, when I get back, when I get the chance to come back here, it's probably going to all have, like, level 3 Pokemon, and I'll probably have all level 20 Pokemon, so. Oh, by the way, my policy on fishing, I'm allowed to fish. Fishing does not count as the same route. So I can technically, if a route has water in it, and I fish there, then that is not my Pokemon for the route, the Pokemon I fish up. I cannot fish another Pokemon after I fish up that Pokemon on the route, but I can catch a Pokemon. So one terrain, one water. Terrain and water, I will classify as different routes. Just because I'm probably going to, because I'm garbage at these games, I'm probably going to need it. Ooh. It's um, Zamazenta. Well, no. Zashian. Zashian. Zashian or Zamazenta. I think Zashian. I think Zamazenta is sh sword. And Zashian is shield. But don't quote me. I love how it tells me the weaknesses and strengths for a Squovet that knows Tail Whip. So scared of Tail Tail Whip, it's the most powerful move. I wonder what would happen if I just growled at this? Would I be able to lose to it? If I lose in the slumbering world, of course I'm not gonna do it because I wanna have my sobble. But, it wouldn't do something silly in another look. I love how we're 19 minutes in the game and we haven't caught a thing. Still on route one. I'll skip until we I'll skip until we get to route one. Oh wow, you angered Zashin or Zamazenta. Whoa. What if I growl at it? Cause I know I know it's not supposed to do damage, like you can't do damage to it. But what if I growl? Can I still do status conditions? No. I know he fires the smoke off. Oh! So I have pee pee. So it hurts my pee pee. So. 
I'm just gonna do this and I'll see you soon when we're unconscious. Yeah, all of you just casually weren't unconscious. Do the fog. Lee, 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 Lee. This is the best line in every po in any Pokemon game ever. How do you manage to find your way here? Your pants with directions. Congratulations, Hop. You deserve some sort of reward for this line. Where's Wooloo? Good question. Where is Wooloo? Oh, it's a Wooloo with no brain. Now watch as this Charizard eats Wooloo because lamb chops. Charizard, do it. We need lamb chops. Well, something I want to try. If you know in this game how they all have certain numbers, Leon is number one, so I can't steal that. But the first Milo, the first gym leader, is 831. So I had an idea. What if I pick 831 as my number? You tell your mum you're heading to Wedgehurst, right? See if she'll spare a word. Oh yeah, we have to get money from her. Someone will battle to the very end for you. Yeah, he will, because if he dies, then that is the end. He'll be in a PC for the rest of his life, because we can't afford medical bills. We can afford potions, but not medical bills. Everyone keep an eye out. This is where we get our first Pokemon. This is also where we end the episode, because we're running out of time. Oh, Wooloo. It's a Squovet. It's a Squovet. Oh, damn it. Well, here's the thing. It was a Squovet. You saw that. It was a Squovet. So we're going to catch a Squovet. If it faints, we don't get a Pokemon with our Squiddle. I'm not very creative with my names. Don't critical hit it. Oh, no, nah, a critical hit would have done nothing. Squove it. It's a level 6 squove it. That's actually not that bad. What? I want to know, what about power? In terms of power, do you reckon we could catch it? Oh, why not? Get in the red. Squove it. He's bite since when did a Squovet learn by? Alright. Here's the thing. If we don't catch it, uh, Sobble's dead. Oh, thank God. If we didn't catch it and it went for bite, Sobble was dead. We are, we are, we are, we are screwed. We're just, we're screwed. We are screwed. We are screwed. We are screwed. We are screwed. Yes, we have to give it a nickname. Uh. No. We're going to name it Alvin from Alvin and the Chipmunk Tripmunks cuz it's a bad movie that has so and it's a bad movie name. I wasn't a fan of the movie. Bad movie. Bad Pokémon. See what other Pokemon. There was a C dot. The C dot. No, it's a Squivet. So uh, it looks like Squivet. Squivets everywhere. Right, let's go. Do we have potions or anything, or are we just gonna play with weak Pokemon? No, it would be stupid to use potions. Eighteen points. Boom. We used. I just did the stupidest thing ever. I just wasted our potions. Also, we're not going to use Pokemon Camp. That can give you a ridiculous amount of XP if done right. That's not cool. I have no idea what's in these houses. So let's go in the house. This house stinks. She didn't give me anything for free. Oh, good idea. Let's do this before it's too late. Let's get some, wait, what berries are these? Come from poisoning, orange berries. All right, I'm gonna carry 12, so two for every team member. Woo, we got an orange berry. 
Now we go to our back. We give everyone an orange berry. Yay! Because if we don't give them orange berries... Wait. Sorry. I don't want to use the orange berry. I want to give the orange berry. <laughs> You're now holding an orange berry. And squirt it. Um, Alvin. <laughs> Do you want to swap its orange berry with an orange berry? Yes, I do. Right. So that's going to close off the videos. Next episode, we will probably we'll hop into the Pokemon Center, get our Pokemon Pokedex, go through the map. If you look, we have a town map. We'll probably, knowing how much dialogue's in this game, we'll probably get to like here, we come back, we go to the station. Drive to, um, we'll probably be in the wild area next episode. We have no clue. Anyway, make sure to like and subscribe for more content. And yeah, Pokemon Part 2 coming soon. Pokemon Nuzlocke.